Here is a strategy type that I personally think is the best strategy to run with automated trading bots. That strategy is a trend following strategy. And over 80% of my automated trading systems run this trend following type of strategy. Trend following is pretty simple in terms of building the strategy. Usually there's a long-term component and a short-term component. The long-term component is looking to determine a long-term trend, usually a 50 to a 200 period moving average like an SMA or an EMA, or also maybe consecutive higher closes or lower closes. And then the short component is what actually enters the trade. There's sort of like a, tr the long component is a trend check and then the short component is the actual entry of the trade. And that's looking for usually momentum in a shorter period of time, such as using an RSI or a MACD or maybe a momentum indicator, for example. So when you compare, when you pair those two components together, the long-term trend and then the short-term uh, entry, you can build a trend following strategy and that's what it usually compi comprises of. Why I think trend following strategies are so good is that when you're following a trend, usually the trend, if it continues, it doesn't work all the time, but if it does continue, a lot of trading systems can get wide ranges of profits, of gains. That's because when a trend is starting to form, there is usually, when there's no stopping it, it can go a lot farther than what you were hoping for. And if you have some strategies that have a trailing stop or an ATR stop, those strategies can win much bigger than usual if a trend starts starting. So that's why I like it a lot. And that's why most of my trading systems use trend following and where I've found personal success with my automated trading systems is focusing on a trend following ideology. The other types of strategies like mean reversion and arbitrage, which I'll talk about in other videos, are just a bit tougher to win where trend following is easiest and I think it's the best place to start when beginners are looking to build automated trading systems and strategies. So let's do an example of what a trend following strategy would be. So for example, and you can test this for yourself, I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but I'm just doing a simple example for you. Check if the current close is above the 200 simple moving average and then enter when the RSI crosses above 70, for example. That would be a simple long-term trend following strategy you would buy and then your exits, you have to test, but maybe put a profit target and stop loss of a two to one. So say a thousand dollars profit target and maybe a $500 stop loss. That'd be a simple example uh, of a trend following strategy. And if you're watching this, go test it for yourself and see uh, if it does well with some instruments that you test it with. So personally, like I said, I found a lot of success with trend following strategies. I think they are the best place to start for beginners on building trading systems. Uh, other trading ideas like mean reversion strategies or arbitrage are much more complex and there's a lot more overhead in terms of developing. So I'd recommend developing trend following strategies for multiple instruments to start a portfolio. Personally, over 80% of my systems trade using a trend following ideology and I've seen a lot of success with trend following and I'd personally recommend it. With that being said, it doesn't work all the time, especially in the last two weeks. If you look at the price action with US indices, when there's no trend forming, when you have days where those instruments are not making new highs or new lows and they're just bouncing back, you end up losing because a lot of your systems will try and find a trend and they're ent enter in one direction, but then get stopped out on reversals. So on those types of days, uh, mean reversion systems would do better, whereas trend following will just chop up, eat up profits, and you won't make any new equity highs until there's a new trend following, a new trend forming, sorry. So those are the weaknesses of trend following and um, that's something where mean reversion would do better. Uh, with that being said, with your trend following systems, you won't win very often, honestly, uh, because on a day-to-day -day basis, there's not new trends happening every day. It's usually a quarterly or monthly event or a news event, uh, but when it does happen, you win really big. So personally, I don't win very often. I have maybe a 40% win rate. I think it's at 39% right now. But when I do win, I win big because once a trend forms the, and volatility matches that, the price action in terms of the open and the close price of that day or over a period of time is so great that a lot of my systems can you know, have bigger profits than average on those trades. I do have some systems that have a small profit target, may only trade once that day and only get a small gain but it's truly this, the trading bots that or trading systems that have a trailing stop or an ATR stop 
they're able to win massive on those trend movements. You just gotta be patient for them to happen. They don't happen every day. And you're gonna have you know streaks of losing periods where chop is happening and you're not making any money and it's very painful and you're doubting your trend following strategy. But once that new trend forms, there's a new news event or maybe a economic event, most trend following systems will do well when uh, that range increases uh, for that price movement. So basically, you know, trend following systems, I highly recommend if you're a beginner in building trading systems. And even if you're an expert, I recommend having a trend following portfolio. They do do very, very well, uh, especially with uh, US indices, commodities, it's a little bit of a different story. Uh, mean aversion will work, work better on there. But if you're trading uh, indices like I am, you know, E-mini, S&P, E-mini, NASDAQ futures, trend following systems are where it's at. They work very, very well. And obviously my success in my previous YouTube videos shows that, that they can do uh, fantastic. So I would definitely recommend maybe starting to build trend following strategies and following that long component and that short term component. Pairing that with a profit target and stop loss will work most of the time. Obviously, you're gonna have to test it, test different entries and different instruments and timeframes, but it does work and uh, I've shown it for myself. So if you wanna learn more about automated trading, more about trend following systems, there's some links in the description below that you can work with me on and I'd be happy to help you to build your own trading system portfolio and help you build trading bots as well. So that's all for the video. We'll see you next week. Peace out guys.